one, it's Halloween Heartthrob, and this is my first time using this uh, new camera, so I'm gonna try my best to uh, to do work with this. Um, I've never used it before to record, so um, yeah, I'm gonna try recording this video. And it is a ball jointed doll tag, which would be number 37 and number 38, and I'll try to uh, make this quick because I don't know how long my uh, my camera will film for. Starting off with number 37, which is telling my family, and my husband and my parents didn't exactly like it, only for the simple fact of it costs a lot of money and they're like how much does it cost and you know at first when I first started collecting dolls um, both husband and parents kind of thought it was a little bit of a waste of money until they saw how much I enjoyed it how much um, creativity I can get out of it and uh, how much time I put into it plus I spend my own money for them so I feel like they just kind of don't exactly love it because of course my parents want me to save my money and my husband just wants me to be happy so I feel like they just kind of got over it because I was gonna do it anyways so <laughs> number 38 favorites tag number one favorite doll I don't have a favorite doll because I love them all um, but I guess most sentimental would be Tadashi here because he was my first doll uh, favorite facelip artist there's quite a few face-up artists that I really enjoy, um, but currently, because my favorite artists change constantly, but right now uh, it'd probably be Delightfully. Um, I really like the way her face-ups are. Uh, they're very cute and happy. Uh, number two, uh, or I'm sorry, number three, favorite outfit. My favorite outfit would either have to be um, Yoko's current outfit or Shizuka's winter like Lolita dress that I made. Number four, favorite thing in the hobby, definitely uh, being able to be creative. Um, the stories and sewing for them, that's the, those are two huge parts of the, creati the creativity I like in it. Number five, favorite company. Surprisingly, one of my favorite companies, uh, and I say one of because there's a couple that I really love, like I really love, um, I think it's called Titan. I know it's like a longer name, but I'm not 100% sure, but I love Titan and Doll Chateau are two of my most favorite doll companies because they're so beautifully sculpted, they're really intricate and uh, unique um, dolls. Uh, but I don't have either of them. Titan and Doll Chateau are both very expensive <laughs> for the dolls that I want. Number six, favorite doll wig. It definitely has to be Yoko's blue wig. Uh, hers was one of the only ones, the only doll wig that I ordered for a doll that kept it because I ordered um, two. One for Tadashi and another one for uh, Shizuka, but Shizuka just wore her original wig and Yoko was the only one to enjoy her wig. So yeah. Plus, I love it and I want it as my own hair one day. Um, number seven, favorite pose. I don't have a favorite pose because I don't like to do the same pose too often. Um, I enjoy my dolls a certain way sometimes, but I like to mix it up so I don't really have a favorite pose. Number eight, favorite resin color. Uh, mostly white or uh, peach skin because they're the cheapest <laughs> but I think anywhere from a lavender because lavender dolls are just so pretty um, or like a, a nice tan those ones are really pretty and the colors look so amazing um, like face-up colors number nine favorite doll size uh, I can't say that I have a favorite doll size because I love Tadashi and him being little and I also love my SD size, but I I don't have an MSD size doll to compare. And to be quite honest with you, I think MSD size might be my favorite. Um, it depends whenever I get one, so. And number 10, favorite doll photo. I'm gonna have to go through my Flickr account and uh, my computer to figure out what that is, but when I figure it out, I'll pop it up on screen. I really hope the camera picked me up well, picked up the sound well, because I really don't want to have to do this video over. 
And uh, thank you guys so much for watching. If you really enjoy my ball jointed doll videos, tune in next Wednesday. And if you want to see me again, tune in Friday. So thank you so much for watching. Like, share, and subscribe. Comments are always welcome. And I'll see you on Friday. Bye, guys.